Scottish girls Robin and Ailey have sweet, lasting memories of the man they called their father, Will Jordan. We had the sack game, which is where we'd sit in a blanket and he'd wrap us up and put us over his shoulder and carry us around the house. <laughs> it was like lots of fun. <laughs> he was like really fun, but then like kind of strict. You knew he cared about you, he would protect you. Robin said her stepdad loved her like she was his own flesh and blood. Instead of it being, you know, him being, you know, more more protective of his own and actual children. He was equally, he loved us all. The moments with their dad, while cherished, were few and far between. Jordan told his family that his covert work with the CIA kept him away from home. We're like, oh, mom, when's dad comes back, he's like, he'll be back soon. So we just like, got on with it. The family got on with things the best they could. Robin and Ailey became big sisters when their baby brother, Zach, was born in 2005. <laughs> Behind the smiling portraits, Jordan was hiding a whopper of a secret. Their mother discovered he had another wife and 10 other children with four different women. Robin and Ailey's attentive dad was really a bigamist and a fraud. They still remember the moment their mother told them the truth. She walked into our bedroom and she was like crying but trying not to cry. She started off like a bit kind of subtle and then she started telling us the whole thing and she bit by bit told us. So the way she told it to us like bit at a time kind of helped to get grips with it. It was almost like a grieving process because <clears throat> it felt like we had lost our dad. Jordan served two and a half years in prison in the United Kingdom for bigamy, fraud and other offenses. In 2009 he was released and deported to the United States. Through his attorney, Jordan has declined to speak with Daywine. Ailey and Robin, now 12 and 15, have not heard from Jordan since he vanished from their lives. I don't really want to invest any of my time or anything yeah. with him. I kind of wish that he would, like, I, I don't want to wish bad on him, but I kind of wish he was put in jail for, like, or arrested for a long time so he wouldn't do it to more people. If he didn't go to jail, I think the likely chance is he'd continue doing it until no one would take him anymore. I just don't want to hurt any more people.